Uh, hello, everybody. Uh, this is next Digest for Time and Solution users. Time and Solution Digest number 30. <coughs> Sorry, my friends. This is must, my post-COVID voice. And um, this Digest about fast Fourier analysis charting tool. Uh, this uh, charting tool allows to conduct cyclical analysis very, very fast in several seconds. And we apply this um, analysis for Bitcoin. Uh, you see, the funny story is I have developed this uh, uh, module uh, for my seven years uh, grandson. He's very good in math and I would like to, and I try to demonstrate him how math works. So you can see the price chart. This is a time domain. And then we convert this uh, uh, price chart to uh, uh, periods domain. So this is period RAM spectrum uh, fast. Uh, Fourier transform, whatever. whatever. So it's, uh, this model actually uh, very good for that to demonstrate. It's uh, very, uh, very clear how it works. Uh, what else? I would like to uh, uh, remind you that a fast Fourier analysis tool. This is not the same as FFT. Uh, fast FFT, fast Fourier transform. But this is another technique. So this is just a regular, uh, regular Fourier analysis. So, let's start. Okay, <coughs> sorry again. Uh, now I switch to timing solution and this is, uh, uh, this is a Bitcoin and uh, this is a measure forecast. Uh, I made this forecast end of June 2024 and uh, you see when I checked this forecast several days ago, I have found that my forecast was wrong. In other words, uh, I cannot explain these two waves. How this cycle, uh, what is that? And um, actually, it's a problem for me. Uh, let's check it. Uh, maybe this is monthly cycle. You see uh, a distance between this and uh, this, uh, this uh, between bottoms, uh, about one month. Uh, we can check it. You see, you can do it this way. Run, uh, run. Um, natural cycle model, set it in backtesting mode, it's already here, and here choose the monthly cycle. So we calculate only monthly cycle, we do not need annual cycle. And you see it does not work, this is uh, um, um, monthly cycle based on all available price history before LBC, before end of June, uh, does not show results. So this is something different. Uh, okay. Do this way. Uh, let's um, do some research. I will make this cycle invisible. Venus synodic cycle, this is measure cycle. I still consider this cycle as major one. So we are waiting uh, uptrend till uh, February. And now <coughs> do this. Uh, run fast Fourier analysis charting tool. It is here. Wave. Oh, sorry. Wave. Uh, fast Fourier analysis and there is short term analysis. Okay. And you see it direct the mouse cursor from uh, last press bar till, 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 till. No, you see, while you move uh, the mouse cursor, the program automatically, you see ye this yellow screen, uh, yellow windows, it shows the periodogram. And you see this periodogram, just a second, this periodogram calculated based on this interval from here to here. So from here to here, uh, this uh, period diagram shows presence of, um, just a second, presence of a 29.3 uh, day cycle. Uh, maybe this cycle works, but you see, my friends, I would prefer to um, move uh, mouse cursor this anchor further. So I move it further and uh, let's check what uh, cycles will work now. You see some new cycle appear. Look at this. This is look like, uh, look at this. This is, it seems to me this is uh, 60.3 day cycle. Maybe this cycle works because you see, <coughs> why? Because uh, 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 out of sample interval, out of sample the interval, you see um, we calculate the period around this uh, using price, price history from this uh, this date to this date. You see this arrow. Uh, but this is interval. This is out of sample interval. We do not use uh, this uh, price history on this interval. 
um, to make a cyclical analysis. I will make it invisible. And uh, you see it's still for a cast. You see this is on out of sample interval. This is cycle 60 uh, days uh, cycle works. Uh, so maybe you can, uh, this cycle works. Once again, out of sample interval, this is price history after this date and before this date. So to calculate uh, this, uh, <coughs> sorry, uh, this uh, projection line, uh, period RAM, everything, we use uh, price history from here to here. And uh, once again, while you move the mouse cursor, you see the program automatically recalculates period RAM. <laughs> Actually, it calculates it fantastically fast. And uh, some features here, you can add more cycles here. For example, I would like to add uh, more cycle. Okay, let's be this cycle. Uh, maybe increase amount of vertons. Also, everything is possible, but uh, I prefer to keep it simple. I will remove this cycle. Uh, so this is uh, what we have. Mm, you see, this uh, techniques is uh, good to analyze uh, cycles a short living cycle. You see this cycle, um, stock memory for this cycle only uh, three. So this cycle lives only three uh, full periods. Maybe it will work mo one more period. So it's risky forecast, I understand. But uh, yeah, this is uh, kind of forecast. But you see my friends, <coughs> sorry, once again, this is cut bit. <coughs> Got it last week, but now it's over. Uh, okay, and you see what else? Uh, back in the uh, end of June uh, 2024, I could not make, uh, could not forecast uh, this uh, oscillation. This is something new. Uh, what this is what we have. Thank you.